YouTube, what up, man? It's your boy, Big Mac. Mac Gang, what up? Welcome back to the channel. Smack life in full effect. Y'all know what I'm here to do. I'm here to drop another life lesson. Nah, just lifestyle. It's a lifestyle vlog, everyday vlog, truck vlog, you know. Uh, what we at? We're somewhere in Pennsylvania. Uh, I just love, man, uh, getting the tire changed. I wanted to make this video. Well, it's one of the uh, See? We're at the loves. You know, we're at the shop. We're getting taken care of. You know how it go. But nah, um, I wanted to make this video because I need y'all to subscribe to the channel. I need y'all to share me to the world. Tell your mammy, tell your pappy, your papa, tell your kids about me. All that, all that good stuff. Oh, I see another super ego driver over there. He chilling. I'm not chilling. As soon as we get this tire changed, phew, we out of there. But, um, nah, uh, the main reason I wanted to make this video, yo, was because, you know, I learned the lesson that my mom taught me years ago. And, uh, my mom, first of all, let's just say this. My mom is my queen, it's my best friend. And I learned a lot of knowledge. It wasn't always given to me. It was earned. I had to take some butt whoopings. You know, 80s baby. Y'all know how it go. But, um, nah, you know, one, one of the things that my mom uh, taught me years ago was keep your receipts. And I'm looking at, I should look at my mom's like, I need to keep receipts for her. Till this day, mind you, I'm 40 years old. My mother has receipts older than me. And, you know, it didn't dawn on me. I mean, I'm not going to say it didn't dawn on me until today, but there has been other instances where, you know, it was worth it, you know, as far as holding a receipt and whatnot. But today was definitely worth it. Being a, a lease operator in this game, you got a lot of responsibilities. So what I'm saying is, even with this company, yeah, you could blow a tire, go get the tire changed. It's still coming out of your check. But if you're making the money and you're putting the money back into your business and your LLC, then you don't always have to rely on the company to pay for your tire to get replaced, fixed, whatever. And in my case, I had to get two trailer tires last week, Friday. Mind y'all, I got super singles on my trailer. Look at my face. I don't like super singles. <laughs> but anyway, <clears throat> long story short, I had to get two tires. One just went to waste. In four days. But, because I kept my receipt, I said, yeah, let me get over here to this love speed code. Gave him the situation, saw him the paperwork, receipt. Ah, oh, man, you get this for free, man. Warranty. That sound like music to my ears. So, that's what we getting done, yo. We getting the tire changed. Um, 
still get points for it. That's another thing, man. Get your points. Use your points in the truck stops. You know, especially if you want to save money coming to the truck stops because we all know as truck drivers, when you park at these truck stops, you're going to spend some money. So, I try to keep it at a bare minimum, man. I stack them points up and uh, I use it to my advantage. Man, they pouring in here. Trucker etiquette. It is, let's just say, 7.30. If you're not in the truck stop by nine parts, parking spot's going to be scarce. This dude come creeping by. I hit my truck. We're going to have a problem, my boy. He just creeping. So I creep. Yeah. No, let me stop. Anyway, um, yeah, it's paying off, you know, getting this tire chest, because everybody know, for those that don't know, super single tires is not cheap at all. Um, where we going? This load is going to... Troutman, North Carolina. I know where I'm going. I got a load of, I forgot what you call them, drinks, man. Ice, sparkling ice, something. Starburst flavor. I was like, damn, I ain't never seen these before. I went inside, like, yo, can I get a case? A lot of y'all don't know, man. You go to some of these places, especially if you're going to pick up a water load. Let me be more specific. can't be more specific. I would have forgot the name of the damn place. It's in Michigan, yo. Stanton, Michigan or something like that. If you're ever in Stanton, Michigan getting a load of water, pay attention. So when you get out that truck to go check in, and you see all them cases of water, flavored water, aquapana, all that, you better snatch them. Listen, I was there... Two, two weeks ago, I still got water. <laughs> still got water. But nah, uh, that's another thing too, man. Why you out here on the road, man? Drink your water, yo. Truck drivers, we sit and drive. Call us steering wheel holders, whatever. But we drive. Drink that water. Your body hydrated, man. Put all that soda down. Them juices, them juices, man. You read them juices, they be talking about 100% juice. Stop the cap. It ain't all juice. You got hella sugars in there. They ain't telling you that because they know you're not finna read that little print at the bottom. Man, what you looking at, my guy? Don't come asking me no questions. I don't know nothing. But, uh, nah, man, like I said, man, drink your water, eat your fruits, veggies, you know, here and there, I eat, like, salads and fruits. Now, I ain't gonna lie to you, I fast in the morning, I don't eat nothing when I get up, or when I get the day started, and it gives me more energy. Learn your own body, everything don't, everything that works for me not gonna work for you. So, you know, find out what works best for you, yo. I'm not going to sit here and say I eat fruits and vegetables every day. Somebody tell you that? Slap them. But, uh, now we're going to North Carolina with this one. Uh, we're going to try to get four loads in for the week. Go home for the New Year's. I'm taking a load on my I'm taking a load home on my back. Something something with a good distance that I could deliver Monday. And then New Year coming around. I'm finna take y'all with me. We finna get on it. I'm finna vlog. Vlog, vlog, vlog. Cause I'ma stay out for like a month. 
have things to do. Uh, things to get. People to support. Family to take care of. Y'all know how I go, man. I ain't gotta I ain't gotta speak on that, man. But um I'm gonna stay here for about a month. And I'm gonna try to go back and forth on the West Coast. I got my boy, my boy Mike, him and his girl. They running the West Coast thing right now, back and forth, you know, Illinois to man, probably Arizona, I think, or Cali. They just they out there. So I'm a solo driver. Yeah, it'd be better if I had a team driver. But y'all know good and damn well it's hard to trust another driver to drive this truck while you sleep. You're not going to sleep like that. I tried. I've done the training. I've done team. <laughs> this is all I can do is laugh about it. Um, I'm not going to give y'all a review yet. I just gave y'all a review on the company. And, you know, like I said in the last video, it's still pumping. It's still going. You know what I'm saying? My last load I did uh, paid me 2800 for 957 miles. Come on. Come on. And it's the thing. The low was paying 23. She got it for 28. You know why? Holidays. Nobody want to take the low. But you know what I did? Give it to me. Give me that freak that. Give it to me. Took the low. Picked it up in right on the borderline. Excuse me, y'all. Right in the borderline of Missouri and Illinois. Get this though. Picked it up. Friday. Was it Friday? Nah, it wasn't Friday. I got there Friday. And uh they was gonna load me. Get this, they was gonna load me. But on my paperwork, it had the door number that they wanted me to go into, but it was a trailer in that door. So the dude was like, yo, pop back in, 645, 7 o'clock in the morning, we got you. And I'm like, damn. I wanted to get loaded right then and there so I could uh, get that coffee, uh, hit the blacktop, uh, be home. I still got home. Granted, I got loaded the next morning. Still went home for all the Saturday, Sunday, pulled out Monday early, early. I put out early. Normally, I don't pull out early like that, but you got your times where you're going to have to. And one thing I noticed with this company, you're going to do some night driving with this company. Oh yeah, gonna do some night driving. So anybody thinking about coming over here to Super Ego, better have your eggs in the basket. Come correct. Um, now nah, like I said, man, I'm gonna stay out for a month. I'm gonna grind, hold it down, pay my bills, stack some money. You know, put it back into the LLC. Put it back in the truck. Make sure the truck is good. And we just going to roll. Because it's winter time. Ain't too much going on. Ain't no point in me being home. I'm a truck driver. That's my job. Get these damn wheels rolling, right? Straight up. Um, yo. I don't have a million subscribers. I don't have a hundred thousand subscribers, but I'm gonna tell y'all what feel good. It's actually seeing a subscriber that watch your channel. I 
I know a few of them now. I done met a, I done met a few of them now. I just met one guy in Missouri. Just getting fueled at the quick trip. And what I told y'all, get that quick trip up, get that cheap fuel. You can only get 50 gallons, but get that 50 gallons. Met dude, we chopped it up. He was like, hey man, um, I'm interested in coming over there, man. What it's like? Listen. I can't sugarcoat it. I'm going to give it to you raw and uncut. I'm not hiding nothing. I'm going to tell you the good, the bad, the garbage, all the above. And y'all may think, oh, man, he giving us good insight into the company, but he ain't really said nothing bad. I can't tell you nothing bad if ain't nothing bad happened to me with this company. Um, I had one one instance, one bad instance, and that was that was because of what I did. I didn't know. And it was with uh, it was with my logs. You know, it messed me up, set me back. I had to, you know, sit a day longer to do a reset. At the same time, I wasn't really tripping. Why? While I was doing my reset, I was right there at my mom's house. So it was like, all right, that's another day I get to spend with my moms and my siblings. I don't know about y'all, but I love my family dearly. I leave them alone. My sisters, my brothers, leave them alone. My mama, mom dukes, leave them alone. Um, but nah, uh, what? Yo, these dudes out here is making parking spots. One dude, you know what I don't like about what some truck drivers do? Hey, I don't care if you want to get on here and comment and say you one of those drivers. You got the right to voice your opinion, and I'm still going to say what I say. I don't like when drivers pull in the truck stop, pull around to the fuel aisle. Let's say you got like eight fuel aisles, right? You got truck, 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 truck. You know what I'm saying? It it, it looked like all the fuel hours is, is is filled up. You got that one truck. He'll pull around and won't pull exactly into a fuel aisle. He'll pull in and stop. Like he playing any, many, mighty mo. Who gonna pull through first? Yo, pull your punk ass do that aisle, pick a aisle, get in the aisle, and wait your turn, bro. Then they get upset when I go around them to go into a actually a actual fuel aisle. Get mad at me all you want. You want to address it? Come talk to me. I'll have a conversation with you. It may not go the way you want it to go, but it's going to go. <laughs> right, Matt? Matt, come say what's up to the world, Matt. Come on. Watch this, y'all. You want to go outside? I bet you want to go outside. Come on, let's go outside. Come on. Look. We're right here. Come out at Matt Life. Come out at the game. Ooh. You see that dog? Where that dog at? Where that dog at? Go get that dog. <laughs> All right, all right. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I was just playing. I was just playing. No, 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 no. I was just playing. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He ain't want no smoke. He's gone. He's gone, Matt. He's gone. Calm down. Easy. Easy, fella. Easy. All right, there. Go relax. Go relax. Go relax. <laughs> Yo, for y'all, for those that don't know, that's Little Mac. Mac is my XL bully. He's been on the truck with me since he was five weeks old. He just turned six, December 6th of this year. It's 
That's my boy. That's my son. I'm Big Mac. That's Lil Mac. And this is Mac Life. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah. Yo. I got an intro coming up too. So, be looking out for that, yo. But like I said, man, in the beginning of the end, man, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell, all that good stuff. Um, as far as the card goes, I know y'all seen the card content. I know y'all seen some of the little gym videos. I'm getting ready to revamp everything back up. I'm getting ready to go get a 100-pound uh, weight set, put it back in the truck. As far as the car goes, new rap coming, but this time it's going to be more aggressive. This this last rap we did was for a car show. It was to stand out, and it was different, but this time... We're going tough. We're going, we're going real aggressive. You know what I'm saying? Mods, engine work, the rap itself, the name that I came up with, it all goes together. Y'all just stay tuned for that. Like I said, I got some work to do. It's time to grind. It's time to get it. Let me encourage you to get out here and get it. Get after it. I'm not no motivational speaker. But I'm going to speak some motivational words today. You better get up and get it because ain't nobody going to do it better than you. That's why I like... I had to catch myself. My previous company was to book our own loads. We had a dispatch. But the way I felt, nobody can find a load better than you because you're going to look Right or wrong. Now, don't take that as me saying, you know, I, I, I find those better than my dispatch. My dispatch, she's funny. How you say that word? She's a uh, phenom phenomenal. I haven't said that. She's amazing when it comes to booking loads. And she always asks me my opinion, what I think. Always. She don't just call with one low. She call with options, choices. Because at the end of the day, it's, it's, it's your choice. It's your truck. It's how you want to move. It's how you want to do it. Look at that. Another super ego in the building. Okay, okay. Coming through. Good looking trailer. Good looking truck. We up here up north. Yo, they had your boy on uh, on uh, repo man duties. I ain't going to say repo man, but recovery man. I'm going to say that. I'm going to say recovery man. And you know what? I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a give a shout out to Super Ego. They called me because I just delivered a load in the area. Where they needed uh, uh, a truck and trailer moved to storage, right? Literally, I was like a mile and a half away from where it was at. Hit me up. Tell me what's going on. Tell me where it was going. All of this happened within 11 miles. Right. So check out what they did. This is what they did. They said, "Can you help us out? We got a truck and trailer that needs to be moved to storage. We see that you in the area. What we can do for you is give you a bonus towards uh, your truck payment. What you mean, give me a bonus towards my truck payment?" Uh, we're going to knock off a uh, uh, percentage of your truck payment uh, for next week. My truck payment is six fifty. Yeah, you'll, you'll, you'll pay uh, $300 uh, next week for your truck payment. 
Word. For 11 miles. Word. I don't know about y'all, but I took that. <laughs> Shoot, $300? For next week's truck payment? Which means my weekly cost gonna go down too. It's cool. It's a little help. I appreciate it. It goes a long way for 11 miles. Come on. So, um, you know, and then, you know, me, to me, doing stuff like that, um, it'll give you a good look in the, in the long run, in the future. They, 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 they may see something else going on or they may have some other things going on and you might pop up on their list. You might be the first to get served. Like my boy, uh, 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 Tommy Shelby said, the last shall be first. Remember that. But, uh, I think they done. Is he done? Yep, they done. Uh, Mac family, Mac gang. We're getting here. Go sign his paperwork. And we're going to get to this blacktop. And we're going to get her done. Y'all know how I end my videos. I appreciate every last one of you. For liking. For subscribing. And just riding with your boy. Continue to do so, man. Good things coming to this channel. I'm patient. Y'all got to be patient with me, yo. Y'all know how it go, man. Y'all stay cool like water. Y'all loves you. All my truckers, male, female, whatever. Keep your wheels down and shine the side up. Cheer, cheer, cheer.